Parramatta star Corey Norman is at the centre. He's under investigation. The wife of... What? Up, mate? Matt. All right, so... <laughs> I'm struggling to deal with you being here. Why are you here? So basically what I'm going to do is, you know, you say that you're good at everything that you do. I'm going to challenge you to cooking, man. All right, me versus you. It's a level playing field, and it's the same ingredient, lamb. Well, thankfully, I'm all right at lamb, and I've eaten your food, and it's not that good. Right. Awesome. <laughs> challenge on. All right. Awesome, man. <laughs> So today I'm going to cook uh, oyster blade lamb. Uh, I'm going to do it with very really slow roasted. With I'm going to marinate it with garlic and rosemary. I've got some beautiful pine mushrooms, ghost mushrooms, some anuki mushrooms, and we're going to do a lovely mushroom broth. And um, basically got some lovely wild garlic flowers, some garlic caress, uh, and then we're going to make a lovely sauce as well. Uh, Matty's going to struggle today, so I've brought my set. Hello, mate. <laughs> Hello, buddy. I thought you weren't going to turn up. I was going to do it all for yourself. Well, I'm used to coming to your restaurant to eat, <laughs> not cook, but that's all right. Um, I you. bought you a gift. It's a cookbook. Oh. I thought you probably need as much help as you can get here today. So can you tell me what you're going to do? So we've got obviously the lamb shoulder. That's going to be beautiful. We're going to infuse that with some rosemary and some garlic. That's going to cook up nicely. Then we've got the coal cannon. That'll be an interesting adventure. All right, let's crack on. So I'm going to get the lamb in first, mate. So I'm going to get the sauce marinated in, in the blender. I'm just going to season my lamb up here, mate. There you go, chef. Oh, you've scored it. That's the first thing he's ever scored in the last three months. Oh, that's uh, funny. Yeah. That's funny. <laughs> so I'm just going to marinate this up, Matty. So that rosemary and garlic. Mm -hmm. I am very nervous. And I get that because this is kind of like being asked to play cricket against Shane Warne. Right, mine's going in the oven, buddy. 160. And that'll do probably two and a half, three hours. I'm going to make a little um, mushroom broth. Cooking beetroots. These are going to take about 40 minutes, maybe an hour. The coal cannon is about to go on. I'm prepping. Yeah. What can I do for you? All of it. <laughs> <laughs> um, why don't you take these beets? Yeah. Thank you, mate. Yeah, if you could just get on that and don't stuff it up. Uh, I'm just going to start making the puree now. All them beautiful mushrooms. Get some squid ink. Mmm. All right. Oh, God, that's amazing. Is that for my dish or yours? <laughs> <laughs> it should be nice and juicy in the centre, so I've just turned that oven up just to give it a little bit of time. You see how the rosemary and the garlic have stuck to the lamb with the salt? Yeah, that actually looks amazing. All right. Because Nell has just gone, yeah, look, I'm going to be a little bit fancy. I'm going to be a little bit basic. Uh, great Australian side salad. But the roasted beet with the citrus, I think, will ideally complement the lamb. Beautiful. I'm going to take this off the bone, Matt. So I'm just going to run this through just to give it a little, still a bit of texture, but I'm going to put the skin into it. I love these little bits on the back of the oyster blade. Right, I'm going to season this up. So, some baby uh, eschalots, which we've just fried off. So I've got this lamb. The size of that bowl is completely disproportionate to the amount of food that's going in it. So these are chimmy de wrapper. I just blanched them in a bit of lamb stock. So I'm just going to fold that. The new keys. See, and this is the key difference between what we're doing here, is I'm going for your more approachable kind of, hey kids, here's something you can try and do at home. Whereas you've put a wilted leaf in a dog's bowl and called it fine dining. <laughs> and then you've got your hot stock, which we'll put into a... Absolutely no need for the teapot. This is purely arrogance. This is showing off now. And then we serve it. Just with a bit of the mushroom broth. And that's your dinner. OK, now you're done. We're going to turn our attention over here. This looks amazing. All right, well done. Oh, this is going to be everything that I wanted it to be. To the coal cannon. That was stressful. This looks amazing. Who's judging it? Because I'm in with a shot. Oh, she's Hello. Here. Hello, my love. Wow, smells good. Oh, trust me, when you sit down, I hope you're hungry. <laughs> it's really good. Oh, it's you're really a terrible good. liar. It's really no. good. Yeah, I'm proud. No, I told really you this. I'm proud. Uh, you ready? So that's your broth made of mushrooms. I found some flowers as well when we went to. Flowers are beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> really good. Is that good? <laughs> Isn't it? <laughs> I am going to say that the winner is my dearest Nelly.
looking at. Oh. She even looked at me when she said it. That's cold. She gets it for that. Thank you. Well done, Matt. This is excellent.